Hi, in this video I will show you how to do field mapping inside a data blend. As an example, I will build a very simple data blend that will retrieve one contact from HubSpot based on an email address. So well, we'll enter an email address and I'm going to save my data blend first. Next, I will output the result to a Google Sheet and I will use the block append one row to sheet. First of all, I will configure the file. I will send it to my test file. Next, I want to have the individual fields from the contact in different cells or columns in my Google Sheet. I will do this by using a lookup. As you can see, there is no lookup data available because the data blend has not been executed yet, so I can start a test run. This is now done, and we can now see the output of the block that retrieves one contact. And I will select the first name. So as you can see, the first name is now mapped to the first column or the first cell in my Google Sheet. I will now do the same and add a last name and finally an email address. I can now run the data blend again and it will now send the data to my Google Sheet. I will quickly switch to my Google Sheet and as you can see the three cells have been added. Please note that you can also click the label to get more details. Uh, when you click it you will see the full path to the output data that we're using and I can also click this view icon to switch to advanced mode. In advanced mode it will show me a JSON path that references the block and the data inside the block that we are using in this cell. Thank you.